Hey everybody, it's Nintendo Dragon Gamer. Welcome back to another exciting part of my Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red Leaf Green. In the last part, we went... We went... Actually, I'm going to say this. We departed from Saffron City and through Celadon City and caught our second, our second Snorlax. Went through Route 16 or was it Route 17, either which, they're practically, the, I guess they're practically the same because their music is the same. But anyways, we went and battled all the bikers, and now we are going to go up against these bird keeper trainers as I explained in the last part before I stopped the video. I always check every grassy area for new Pokemon. Hmm, I think that's a good idea. Huh. Yeah, I need to like. I underestimated, I guess. Pharaoh. Um, it's this is not like a big um scare to me, but um, that Lapras is just in the last part. I like trained Lapras a lot, like five levels, I assume. As I did promise in my last part, that in the next part, which would be this part, that we're going to head to Seafoam Islands. And I am promising you that, that we are going to do that. So, we're, most of this part we're going to go up against, um, we're pretty much going to go up against a lot of swimmers in this part. Right after we go up against these bird keeper trainers, we're going to go to Future City, um, heal at the Pokemon Sitter, then, then start departing south. The part, we're going to depart Future City and... Head down south to Route 20. And Route 21, I guess. I really, like, don't know the exact routes exactly, but I know exactly where we're going. So, at least I know where I'm going. That's the good part about it. Huh. <laughs> That first little phrase in the subtitles was a little weird. I guess it was his bird call. Dodrio. You're probably going to get a lot of experience points out of this one, viewers, if you're really trying to train a Pokemon that can really do lots of damage to bird Pokemon, like an ice Pokemon like Lapras or Electric or Rock type. This would probably be a perfect matchup for you guys who are trying to train. One thousand one hundred fifty experience points. I can go with that. That's a lot of experience points. Okay, so we're now gonna head to Fuchsia City as we are right now, and and um, what was I trying to talk about? Oh, I'm gonna tell you this: Seafoam Islands. You will need um strength in order to get to a legendary bird, which I'll probably get to later. Oh, and we'll probably need, like, a Pokemon that can learn strength in the process. I'm probably gonna skip, like, I might be, I might have a pattern, whether or not, um, I'm just gonna maybe skip a trainer, then do a battle, and skip a trainer, then do a battle. I'm not sure if I'm, I'm really gonna do that or not, but, um... I mean, 
I'm just gonna use Snorlax. I mean, Snorlax can use Strength, so can, um... So can, um... Hitmonchan. Okay, wait a second. I need to go to the TM case. Open. Okay, that has Strength. Use. Yes. Okay. Uh, let's get rid of, um... I don't know. Snore. Because really, you only can use Snore while the Pokemon is asleep. So I probably wouldn't recommend Snore that much. But... I guess I can say it's an okay move overall. Okay, now we're going to depart Future City and head down, oh, Route 19. I get really confused, viewers, like, really confused. Now we're going to, now we're just going to switch and we're going to do that. These battles will go really quick, so I'm not going to skip them. I mean, I might skip some of them just to get this video to move along and get to Seafoam Islands because there are a lot of swimmers. I don't think I've trained, i not trained, but I don't think I have taught Raichu Iron Tail yet. I need to remember to go back to the game corner and get that. But right now, um... I'm not focused on that, so it's not like a big um it's not like a big deal to me, but I mean I'll I will do it later. Like it's not the most important thing at the moment. Wait, slow down, you'll have a heart attack. A heart attack? You gotta be kidding me. I'm a character in the game that's not even an adult. So really, how Nick could I have a heart attack? I mean, seriously. I mean, a heart attack can be really bad. I mean, I mean, some people could die from a heart attack. That'd be really bad. Honest to God, that'd be very bad. But anyways, um. I'm just going to stop reacting to what that um, subtitle said, like the word heart attack. I mean, I'm not going to overreact over that stuff. Um, if you are playing Fire Red version, you'll be able to fish for a shelter. If you're playing Leaf Green, you will be able to get a Star U and then evolve it into a Star Me. Level 43. Nice. I think I have a rep... Okay, I'd be right back. I'm gonna go get some repels. Okay, I'm back with some max repels. Um, we're now gonna proceed heading south and heading south... Heading, um... I guess south south, um, west to see from islands. We're gonna use a max repel. I have ten of them last time I checked. Yep. Use. I tried diving for Pokemon, but it was a no-go. Well, obviously, if you were a scuba diver, that'd be a different story. But since 
You don't have like an oxygen mask and a tank with you. I think that wouldn't that would make perfect sense. You could dive, but when you say a no-go dude, um Yeah, you're right, because you only could hold your breath for for X amount of minutes or seconds. Oh, okay. Shelter. And use another wine, vine whip. Just keep feigning the Pokemon. I would, I would recommend you viewers, if you are right now in the water on Route 19 and 20 and 21, I recommend in this area you use the Verse Seeker, because you could train your grass Pokemon all you want. Um, experience points galore, I guess? <laughs> I wouldn't say galore, but yeah. What's beyond the horizon? <laughs> Good question, sir. I don't know the heck no. Okay, okay, come on. Thank you. I think this trainer, I, this swimmer has a tentacruel. I might not be correct, but it's a possibility. Because as you can very well see, I think he had a horsey, two tentacruel. This is the second tentacruel, so possibly... Eh, maybe a Seedra, or maybe just a, um, Tentacruel. I'm only about to Tentacruel. Oh, Goldeen. My bad. <laughs> I mean, I probably, I would, I would, I would not even be able to remember every single Pokemon from each trainer individually. That would be pretty weird to remember all of the Pokemon from each swimmer, bird, um, juggler, or any of those types of trainers. Okay. Right here, we're gonna have a double battle. Um, if you're really gonna have a double battle with, with, um, I guess that's a that's a little brother and, and big sister there. Um, as that as that opposite team. Um. Yeah, I'm ready. My big sis taught me how to swim and train Pokemon. How nice, kid, but I'm gonna go up against you. Yeah, sis and bro, Leah and Luke. I guess that's how you say it. Yeah, something like that, as I just explained. Okay. Um. Razor Leaf. Uh, Thunderbolt. Nice, level 44. The special defense is his second is her second highest stat, and that's really that's actually really good. This battle's gonna be over pretty quick. Oh wow, someone Someone tougher than my big sis. 
Uh, yeah, I am tougher than your sister, kid. Ahoy there! These waters are treacherous! <laughs> I don't see them treacherous. <laughs> I don't know when they're treacherous, sir. Okay, I think this whole entire team is full of tentacle. And I think one tentacruel. If I'm not mistaken. You know, I might not be able to go to Seafoam Islands, but we're underway as we speak. We're heading there, we're just battling trainers in the process. I was right, a tentacruel. I might be skipping two trainers so I don't waste too much time. I mean... I mean... I guess going up against trainers way too much in one Let's Play video, I think would be, um... I would say is too much. So I'd probably skip some of them just to make it a little faster. Dangerous. <laughs> yeah, treacherous waters are dangerous, but the waters are not what the ocean is and dangerous. Okay, I'll see you after this battle. And this one too. And this one also. That should be it. Strong trainers and water Pokemon are common sights in these parts. They say that Misty of Cerulean City trains here. Okay, um... One more, and that's it. Viewers, um, now I'm going, I, I'm going to be right back, I'm going to go, I'm going to, um, heal my Pokemon in Fuchsia City, be right back. Okay, viewers, I guess this is it for this part, um, so next time on my Let's Play Pokemon Fire Red Leaf Green, we are going to go explore Seafoam Islands, I'll see you in part 36. Bye.